Hello, my lovely students. In the last class, my dear students, we have seen and learned the revision of uh, the topic singular and plural nouns. So, singular means the single things, place, uh, sorry, the single uh, things or single, no, that. Uh, so, here. Again, the word plural comes. More than one, it is called the plural. And I have given the three points that how we can form three points that how we can form uh, singular into plural. So, third in the third point, I have said that when the noun it end with uh, y and uh, if we are having the consonant just before it then we need to remove that y then what we will add we add ies that i told you if there is a consonant just before that y then we need to add ies by removing y but here in the point four my dear student we need to add s only to the singular noun if there is a y at the end of that noun but just before it if it is a vowel then we need to add s not ies in the previous uh, in the point number third uh, we have learned that if there is a if there is a y at the end of the noun and just before it if there is a consonant letter then we have to remove that y and we write ies but here vowel is there and the last uh, letter it is uh, y we will not remove the y but we add only s here you see the last letter is the last letter is uh, y and just before it what is there vowel is there for so we will not remove this y, we will just add s to make singular into plural boy, boys. Here again same thing. The last letter is y. If y then has a vowel before it. If this y has a vowel before it, vowel is e is there. So vowel it has a vowel, then we will add here also s day again in singular day same y and this vowel y at the end and just before it vowel then what we will do we will add s we will add only s okay then again monkey here also you see the last letter y and just before it vowel e e is a vowel yes or not a e i o u these are vowels and if you get before this y the vowel then you will not remove this y you will not remove this y you will what you will do you will add s only at the end of that word so this is what point number four to form uh, singular into plural noun now point number five you see by changing f by changing f or f e you we will change f or f e okay what we will do f or f e we will change into v e s if the singular noun it has f at the end of that word or f e then we will change this f for f e to v e s we will make it v e s suppose here car c a l f this is a singular now so how we will make this singular into plural so last letter is f f is the last letter so if f is there or f e is there if f is there and f e is there then we will remove this f and f e then we will write v e s we will write what we will write we will write v e s 
So C A L F then C A L V E S C A L V E S cops thief T H I E F thief then thieves knife then knives life lives only you we need to add V E S V E S by removing F or F E again point number six by changing the inside vowel what we will do here in the point number five sorry first let's see in this point number five in this point number five there are some exceptions are there that some words are there that do not that do not follow that do not follow any what rules here here you see in this words chief f is there but we will not change or remove this F or FE and write VS. We will not do here. We will not do in this case. These are some of the words. Uh, so we will not follow these rules. So chief is there. We will write S. Cliff, cliffs. Drop, drop. Hook, hooks. Proof, proof. Roof, roof. Girl, girl. Stuff, stuff. Root, root. So these are some of the what? Uh, words are there that we will not uh, follow the point number five rule. Okay, so again point number six is there the inside vowel we will change it O double O. So this is vowel. No, we will change this to double E fit Goose double O. We will change to double E Tooth double O. We will change this to double E Louse we will change this O and U to I lies. Man, we will change this vowel to E. So these are some of the words that we can make plural by changing the inside vowel. By changing the inside vowel. Again, in point number five, what we will do by adding by adding en by adding en like child child children en we what we have what we have added added here child children so r e n no by adding r e n and by adding e n so these rules we can make singular into plural again point number five what is there point number five we will have some nouns we will have some nouns that have having singular and plural alike in the singular also and again in the plural uh, they are same like dozen in singular also dozen in plural also dozen in singular also dear in plural also dear in singular fish plural also fish in singular sheep plural also sheep in singular yo plural also yo so they will not change okay same we will write this as same plural a singular and plural alike so all this about this lesson my dear students in the next class we will see uh, another topic uh, the revision part so uh, along with this video my dear students i will give you some homework so that you can do it at home so uh, i will give you time if you want to write this in on your copy so i will give i will stand that side so the blackboard will be visible to you so you can write it okay thank you today this much only we will see again in the next class thank you very much